okay students so today we will discuss this is your chapter 10 and history so this is from new learnel book new political formation in the 18th century so today we will discuss all question answer in this video one by one okay so let's start come to the question answer so first question question number one he occupied the throne after the death of Farooq Shah. so the option a Muhammad Shah. answer is option a Muhammad Shah. then uh, question number two Ahmad Shah Abdali was the ruler of Afghanistan okay the next question number three this was the first state to gain independence from Mughals that is Bengal option a that is Bengal he was the founder of Hyderabad who Nizam ul Mulk Nizal Nizam ul Mulk Mulk uh, option B then come to the fill in the blank so first is the Mughal Emperor Aurangzeb died in 177 next question number two M Ahmad Shah Abdali invaded India dash times eight times then question number three the state of Das was founded by Hyder Ali Moishur uh, question number four Banda Singh Bahadur was executed in 1760 Das worked as the finance minister of the Maratha kingdom Nana Pahadab Nana Fandanivs then question number C what is the word Maratha word then very short answer type question number one who founded the state of Mysore in 1760 CE question number one the state of Mysore was uh, founded by Hyder Ali by overthrowing the ruling dynasty in 1760 CE next question number two who were known as the kingmaker during the period of late Mughals Said brothers were known as the kingmakers during the period of the late Mughals. Next question number three. Which states fall under the category of Watan Jagir? Gujarat falls under the category of Watan Jagri. Next question number four. Who are known as the late Mughals? Name any two and their period of region. The Mughals who ascended the throne after the death of Aurangzeb are known as the late Mughals. Bahadur Shah E ruled 1770 to 1712 CE. Farooq Siyar ruled from 1713 to 1719 CE. Then short answer type question. So first is D. Who was Sibaji? Write the brief note on him. Sibaji was born on 20th April 1627 CE at Sivnar in Pune. Maloji, the, uh, the grandfather of Sivaji, rose to prominence in the Nizam Sahi kingdom of Ahmednagar. Maloji's eldest son, Sahaji's, Sahaji, father of Sivaji, married Jijawai daughter of Lakhaji Lakhaji Jadav Jadav Rao Sahaji was a Jagirdar in the Bajpur government Sivaji was greatly influenced by Jijabai his guardian Dadaji Kondadeva and Guru Ramdas childhood contact with such powerful and Dominating personalities promoted Sibaji to crave out an independent state. Then, question number two 
हाउ मेनी टाइम्स डिज अहमद शाह अब्दाली इन्वाडेड इंडिया नेम द फेमस बैटल फॉट बाय हिम अहमद शाह अब्दाली वाज द रूलर ऑफ अफगानिस्तान ही इन्वाडेड इंडिया एट टाइम्स टू प्लूडर इट्स वेल्थ ही फॉट द थर्ड बैटल ऑफ पानीपत विथ द मराठा इन सेवेंटीन सिक्सटी वन क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री हू वी आर द फाउंडर्स ऑफ इंडिपेन्डेंट स्टेट्स ऑफ बेंगल आवज एंड हाइद्राबाद फाउंडर्स ऑफ इंडिपेन्डेंट स्टेट्स आर बेंगल मुर्शिद कोइल खान आवज सदात अली खान सो हाइद्राबाद निजाम उल मुलक मुल्क देन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर व्हाट वाज डाल खलासा हाउ डिट द डाल खलासा टेक इम्पोर्टाट डिशिशन्स सो आफ्टर द एक्जिक्यूशन ऑफ बंदा बहादुर द सिक्स सिख और ऑर्गेनाइज देम स्लिप्स इन टू ए नंबर ऑफ जाट्स दीज जाट्स वे आर नोन एज डाल खलासा द इम्पोर्टाट डिशिशन्स of dal khalasa we are taken in the presence of sri guru granath sahib at akal takahat amritsar these decisions we are mostly taken on the occasion of diwali and baisakhi next question number 5 describe year, uh, yearly conquest of shivaji in uh, 1646 only adil shah the sultan of vijapur fell ill taking advantages of this of this situation shivaji started a series of conquest by capturing the toran fort in 1646 so by 1648 he established his control over the fort of purandar kondana Konkan, Kollan, and Singara. In 1660 CE, he occupied the fort of Panhala, Basantagar, and Khelna. At the end of 1662, the uh, he compelled Sultan Adil Shah to sign a treaty according to which Adil Shah accepted Shivaji as independent ruler. long answer type question question number 1 critically evaluate the emergence of bengal as an independent state bengal was the first independent kingdom to be carved out from the mughal empire it was founded by murshid quil khan in 1707 who made murshidabad as his capital he was succeeded by his son in law souz ud din in 1727 after his death in 1739 safaraz khan ascended the throne who was an incompetent ruler and the real power was enjoyed by alam chand and haji amda ahmed in 1740 Alwardi Khan became the new ruler of Bengal he prohibited both the French and the British from the increasing their influence in Bengal he was fond of art and literature and patronized many scholar in this court after uh, the death of Alwardi Khan in 1756 he, his grandson Siraj ud Dullah became the the Nawab of Bengal, who had to face the problem with his own relatives. On the other hand, the British East India Company were also trying to increase its influence in Bengal by making fortification. But Siraj ud Dullah checked their influence and ordered them to stop their fortification then question number 
स्टेट ऑफ मॉइश्यूर वाज फाउंडेड बाय हाइदर अली इन 1760 सी ही रूल्ड टिल 1782 सीई एंड मेड मॉइश्यूर ए पावरफुल स्टेट ही ट्रेंड हिज आर्मी ऑन मॉडर्न मॉडर्न लाइंस विद द हेल्प ऑफ द फ्रेंच ईस्ट इंडिया कंपनी द ब्रिटिश ईस्ट इंडिया कंपनी डिड नॉट टॉलरेट द इंक्रीजिंग इन्फ्लुएंस ऑफ हाइदर अली एंड बिकेम हिज सोर एनमी two fierce battle took place between them the first anglo moishur war ended with the british defeat at the hands of hyder ali while during the second anglo moishur war hyder ali died suddenly on 7 december 1782 uce after his death tipu sultan became the ruler of moishur he wanted to totally focus on the british and therefore signed a treaty with the marathas the third and the fourth anglo moishur wars were fought between tipu and british at the end of which tipu was finally defeated after his death in 1798 the british annexed his territories next question number 3 in 1666 sikh guru Tek Bahadur Singh was martyred by the Mughals after him Guru Gobind Singh became the 10th Sikh guru who fought many battles battles against the Mughals in 1699 he established Khalsa Panth at Anandpur Sahib to fight against the injustice after his death at Nanded in 1708 ce the khalsa continued their struggle against the mughal authority under the guidance of banda singh banda singh bahadur khalsa declared this uh, sovereign uh, rule between uh, sultes and yamuna region Banda Bahadur continued his struggle against the Mughals but was caught by the Mughal executed 1716 CE after after execution the six organized themselves into a number of jats called Dal Khalsa Then last question question number 4 who was Tipu Sultan right in brief about achievements so tipu sultan was the son of hyder ali of moysur after the death of his father he became the ruler of moysur in 1782 he brought many reforms in his administration he himself was a brave soldier was uh, as well as a patriot and was a tolerant ruler who treated all regions equally he is known as the tiger of moysur due to his bravery tipu sultan wanted to concentrate on the growing power of the british east india company due to which he signed the treaty with the marathas after the third and the fourth anglo moishur wars tipu was defeated and his territories were annexed by the british so that's it's the end so don't forget to uh, like share and subscribe thank you